Hello, welcome to Linda Likes Tarot. Hi, my name is Linda. If you're new, welcome. If you're returning, what's up? I'm glad that you're back. Okay, so today is going to be a collective reading or whoever is meant to be for. Today, this reading is going to be about the new moon in Cancer. We're going to figure out what's going on, what we can expect, okay? Let me put this over here. Okay, so I was debating on whether I wanted to do this or not. Okay. Boshka knows. Boshka knows. And I finally was like, let me just flip out one of these uh, cards and see what comes out from the uh, Moon Oracle. And the card that came out was Prosperity Lies Ahead, New Moon in Taurus. So whatever... Whatever the new moon is going to bring, it's gonna it's gonna be good, is what it is. Especially if you're someone who's been doing the work. If you're if you're someone who's in your north node, um, actively in your purpose, have done um, healing work with when it comes to childhood traumas, okay, and just traumatic experiences with exes in general, okay, breaking bad habits. Um, cutting off uh people negative people because if you're still if, okay if you're watching me and you're still surrounded or connected to someone who is negative or you know who is um karmic this person is blocking you so if you want this prosperity you you that's why we that why this is why us tarot, tarot readers say to release things and people that no longer serve you okay um it doesn't matter if it's your own damn mama doesn't matter if it's your cousin doesn't matter if it's your current boyfriend it, it does not matter if it's like your boss like these are things that you should have been doing okay for some of you depending on what part on the journey you are on okay um i also would like to make a psa okay and what i mean like release them i'm talking about just distance yourself no communication try to get this person out of your energy okay that doesn't mean be mean to them that doesn't mean um hate on them that doesn't mean wish ill will on them that's not what i'm saying okay um also for a lot of you okay I'm, i've been doing personal readings for some people and a lot of you are getting confused about um if what you're watching on YouTube, the readings, if it is for you or not, okay? If you have just woken up on your journey, this this spiritual inheritance that we keep speaking of, it, this is probably not on your timeline right now. But for a lot of you who have been on this journey for a while, this could be your time for your spirit, your spiritual inheritance to come in this year. I can't talk. This year, the year of seven okay um so i'm gonna make that abundantly clear because there's some people here who are thinking like say that you just had a spiritual awakening in january and you're finally um or you just discovered tarot on youtube and you're like oh i'm getting this windfall da, da, da. you're probably not you're probably still connected with weird people okay um you probably still have a lot of healing to do and that doesn't mean like you know what i mean that it's bad it just means that you have to you need to continue to go further down your journey okay this is for some of y'all i'm gonna make this clear okay bomb deck we have luck is on your side okay so i could be talking to a sagittarius or i could be talking to a taurus who's going to be getting some sort of um abundance here or some sort of positive news soon with this new moon okay we have a personal issue reaches resolution. So if you're having or experiencing any troubles in your life right now, it is going to be resolved, okay? I could be talking to a cancer. Tell me more, sir. I'm also getting, because this is the, it's showing like the new moon to the full moon. So something about this moon cycle, um, there's going to be things that are going to be definitely changing, okay? Tell me more, Spirit. 
we have step out of your comfort zone north node see so no wonder so you know how i was just ranting and raving in the beginning of this read some of y'all if you don't know what your north node is okay you need to start doing this work you need to start doing this research i have a link down below in my description box the little the little, you can click on the word that says more click on it then down in there it's going to tell you a bunch of stuff i get i give out a lot of information there's a link that i've post or paste on there um it's a free link to a website to where you can find out your natal chart your birth chart okay you're gonna need to know your name okay pretty easy you're gonna need to know the place that you were born the time you were born and your your birth date okay and then once you look at your chart your north node is gonna look like this little horseshoe situation all right and then you need to start Googling or looking up on YouTube, people with such and such no North Node. And then learn about yourself, okay? All right, we got a win-win outcome is forecasted. So there's a lot of Libra energy here as well. So I feel like um, there's a lot of justice, karmic justice is gonna be coming for, for y'all. Tell me more, excuse me. Yeah, look, I just pull out the deck and it says, call in protection, Archangel Michael. Whoever I'm talking to, Archangel Michael is working very closely with you. Okay. My legs just got all tingly when I said that. <laughs> Holy Spirit, Holy Angels. Can you tell me more? What's going on here? Tell me more what's going on here for them when it comes to this new moon. Thank you. Okay. We have terraform your world, and then we have raise your frequency. Let me get one more. Thank you. And we have go back and refresh. That's the bottom. Then we have go your own way. Go your own way. What is that song? Dun, 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 dun. Go your own way. I think that's like an 80s song or something. So whoever I'm talking to, you're someone who decided to take your own path. You like, whoever I'm talking to, you could have left a lot of people behind. I'm also, for whoever I'm speaking to, you could have or own like a puppy or a small dog. She has a little small dog in her hands. Okay. Something about bunny rabbits is very significant for you. Or um, wolves are significant for you or could be your spirit animal. Okay, you definitely have a male ancestor that is watching over you. Let's see. Ooh, chow, listen. I'm not going to even get into that yet. Spirit, tell me more. Okay, the cosmic cervix. It says, whatever you envision, you can create. If it does not harm the universe, the the universe will support it, but know what you want. Oh, okay. So yeah, it's manifestation time, guys. Anything that you want, you can create. It's possible. Thoughts create reality. Okay? So let, it's time to do it. Okay? It's time to do it. Literally, like it's like the cosmos are like opening themselves up for you in order to birth something okay you guys could be seeing whales pictures of whales or seeing actual whales or dolphins okay or octopuses
yeah something about a vision board could be significant for you guys you might need to work on a or or spend time looking at your vision board or create one or paint a picture of what your ideal world would look like okay it says bringing a vision into physical manifestation is very powerful okay ciao spirit is speaking today Tell me more. We got raise your frequency. It says activate the 12 strands. It says aspire to raise your frequency so you can access the codes for the next level. You are meant to be a trans dimensional being. Ciao. Some of you could have long wavy hair. Your hair could be red. Okay. Let me see. Yeah, it's time to affirm, like, what you want into this world, okay? You could be a play, uh, you could be from, um, what's it called? You could be a, a Palladian or a Lyran. If you don't know what those things are, look it up. Look up the traits of what a, a Palladian is and a Lyran and see if it resonates okay listen i feel like i need to like i don't know hold a class i don't freaking know listen because i get a lot of emails with people asking me like oh linda can you do a reading to tell me if i'm a lemurian or or, or if i'm a lyran or a palladian or a syrian and blah, blah 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 like i'm gonna be honest i feel like it's not my place to be telling you that. Like, that's something, like, you should be getting that confirmation from the divine. Like, through meditation. Or through dreams. That's what I feel like, okay? Um, because that's what happened with me. So, I don't know. That's just what I feel like. Yeah, there's something here that you're going to find out about your DNA here. There's something about your DNA that's going to be activated, okay? DNA activation. I'm also getting like something about a DNA upgrade. Some of you are going to be getting a DNA upgrade while you sleep. Okay, let's see. I'm also getting like... Mm -mm. okay let me keep going we have go back and refresh this is the nine maidens of i don't even know how to say this kalaish it says retrace your steps return to the beginning there have been many trials and tribulations along the way but you can always start over with a fresh perspective okay so it's time to start thinking with a clear mind or not like a clear mind but like what's the word like 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 it says like a fresh perspective like start start viewing the world as like it's your oyster like anything is possible like don't don't allow the trauma to create some a negative filter when you when you look at the world, when you look at people, when you look at relationships, when you look at love, okay? When it when you look towards your future, it's time to think very positive because you have the ability to create a new essentially a new life for yourself, okay? Some of you can benefit from um, going near water, okay, like a river or a lake or an ocean if you live by one. Someone could live in Ireland or could be of Irish descent. Then this also says, you have an opportunity to break old, outworn patterns. So stepping back from a situation will breathe new life into it. 
So it's time to take a, it's time to have a little retreat for yourself. Okay. Because whatever these um, DNA upgrades that are coming in for you, it might make you kind of tired. Okay. Because you're going to be, you're going to be uh, experiencing a form of like a renewal in the physical body. Okay. Dang, what is going on, spirit? Oh, let's go your own way, spirit. Okay, it says you have the right to choose to live outside the accepted paradigm and social system. Protect the defenseless creatures who also have the right to live. Let's see. So you guys, um, what the? Wow, okay, creepy. So right now, like it, if you guys are feeling the need to be adventurous and to go out, okay, and explore new territories, the, the time is now, okay? Um, don't limit yourself on, like, where you want to live or um, what you want to be when you grow up or whatever this is, okay? you The possibilities are endless for you, okay? The universe is supporting you. Let me see, what else? Okay, because look, I cut the deck and we got justice here. And then we got five of Michael. So you guys are going to be receiving justice for um, basically all the things that people have done to try to sabotage you, basically. Okay. I'm also getting, you're going to be receiving this justice because you decided to um, release things and attachments that do not serve you because that's also what this five of michael is about okay Time more spirit. i'm also getting like your spirit team is fighting for justice for you right now so if you're over here thinking that it's not happening you're wrong because it is happening yeah you guys are definitely starting some sort of new beginning here spirit what's going on Yeah, look, a lot of inner child work. We have six of Raphael. It says, embrace your inner child. New friends or rekindled relationships. Children or childhood. Okay. So I'm getting something about, like, doing things that will make your inner child, like, happy. Okay. Like, it, it could be just as simple as, like, going and going to the grocery store and buying, like, a snack that <clears throat> maybe growing up, like, you weren't allowed to eat or something or like the name brand gushers or the name brand cereal that you always wanted to eat but something like that going out and going down a slide at the park i don't know something whatever whatever you've been wanting to do do it painting if you loved painting as a child start painting again okay if you liked um whatever this is i'm giving you enough examples okay i'm also getting you guys are gonna meet chill you're not gonna meet children you're gonna meet people <laughs> can't um you're gonna meet um you're gonna meet new friends okay that are gonna bring out like this this really fun side out of you okay or you you both will be able to act goofy and childish with each other okay but like childish in a good way Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, can you tell me more? We have Ace of Gabriel. It says a gift of passion, opportunity, and inspiration. The chance to do something amazing. A sense of wonder. Listen, y'all. You got something really good coming in, okay? Like, really good. I'm also getting, you need to follow your freaking passions. Okay, I don't know if you guys are afraid of some shit. Let me get this gosh dang what the fear is out here. Decoding the fear. 
whatever whatever this passion is that is like really driving you to want to go do this or you really enjoy doing it whatever this is okay you're the reason why you keep getting like nudgled to do it or your intuition keeps trying to like take you back to this or keeps reminding you like hey so and so like hey collective you need a paint hey collective don't you remember you like knitting hey collective don't you remember you like making jewelry hey collective blah 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 okay the reason why this is happening all the time is because you're receiving divine guidance okay says the search for meaning in life consider an alternative approach surround yourself with wise teachers or friends okay tell me more spirit okay some of you could be very worried we have your worry is unnecessary focus on your thoughts on the outcome you desire release feelings of regret guilt or worry to your angels some of you feel like if you get this prosperity you feel like you're going to be guilty or you're going to feel guilty for doing good while you're witnessing everyone else going down. I That's not, you have to let that go. Okay. We got to change your life. Your life is about to freaking change. It says a sudden revelation that offers freedom, break free of procrastination, embrace the opportunities that change begins. Change is here. Okay. Let's find out why the hell you afraid or what's up with this fear. What? Let's give you some let me shut up. <laughs> Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, what's going on with them? What do they need to hear with this worry energy they got going on? The fear energy they got going on? Thank you. Listen, we have question your motivations. Are they based on fear? So some of you could like be doing certain things and you're not realizing you're moving a certain way or not allowing yourself to do something or holding yourself back out of fear. It's all based on fear. You guys may not want to go outside because you're fearful. You may not want to go out and talk to other people because you're fearful. You might want to. You might not want to go try out uh, new restaurants because you're fearful that you're gonna get poisoned or something. You might not. You might be fearful to not go to the beach because I don't know. You're afraid someone's gonna drown you or something. Listen, you need to not be fearful. Don't allow fear to hold you back. Fear comes from the devil, okay? Fear also is something that comes from your ego. Not what your heart wants. Don't fear judgment, confrontation, and lack of acceptance. These interactions are designed to filter out those who don't deserve to be in your life. There's people, whoever I'm talking to, you, you got people around you that you need to let go, okay? And I always feel so weird saying this to people because growing up as a Jehovah's Witness and and when I was um, a Scientologist, I, they're kind of like the same type of like religious um, model, not the same teachings, but like the way they operate. It's like if one person is no longer a part of the church, then like that person must be ostracized like you have to no longer talk to them speak to them blah 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 um so that's why i feel weird about saying it but at the same time it's like this is this is not to punish because usually when they do that it's to punish that person who has left okay you're doing this to protect yourself in a sense I hope that makes sense. Okay. And no hate to those religions. Do you. Whatever. Okay. I'm also getting like some of you don't want to go after your passions or even showcase your passions or your art even or your music or whatever you do. Um, some of you may, are like afraid to start your own platform. Okay. Listen, been there, done that. I know exactly what that is. Do not wait three years to post your first video like my dumb ass. Okay. Please don't do that to yourself. Um, don't allow the fear of rejection. Okay. I feel like this is something that has been like, this is something that you have been that has been conditioned within you to feel like this for, for some of you to feel like no one's ever going to accept you. But listen, 
If you build it, they will come. You will find your soul tribe. They will gravitate to you, okay? Especially when it comes to your music or your art or whatever your passion is. Say you like collecting teddy bears or cups. I don't know what you do, okay? If you're into that, they'll people are going to want to view it. People view a lot of things, okay? Spirit, <laughs> I need to stop rambling. Tell me more spirit. What is going on? Okay, we got to take a leap of faith. It says the results may surprise you. Listen, some of y'all are worried about taking some uh, leap of faith because you feel like you're going to risk something or you're going to lose something, but you're not. The universe is literally protecting you, okay? They are going to be supporting you the whole way. And I'm also getting something about communication is key. Oh, something about asking for what you want or asking for support from the divine, okay? Because because help will be sent your way or the right people will be put into your path to help you achieve what you have to achieve or manifest what you're trying to manifest. What else? What else do they need to hurt? We have don't back down from opposition. Show strength and fortitude. Bull. It's time to be stubborn about what you want. About what you want to manifest. Okay? Yeah, look, we have crib. It says birth or conception of a child or an enterprise. Some of you really want to start a business, center around the thing that you're passionate about. It's time to do it. Just as hard as you work at your normal job, try working as hard as you do with this passion and you might you might surprise yourself. Okay? Tell me more spirit. And I feel like whatever this passion is, it's something that you've been doing since you're a child. Okay? Ew, tell me more. There's someone here that admires you. You got a little secret admirer out here. We got money path. It says a path with money is waiting for you to find it. Ciao. Someone wants to give you your flowers or something. Or someone might actually give you flowers. Okay. I'm also getting like whatever this prosperity that lies ahead. Remember when you receive this, it could be in the form of money, a new relationship, um, of some sort of lucky break, whatever this is. Okay. Remember to remain humble. Okay. Pride is always before the fall. So always remain humble. Tell me more spirit. November. Something about the month of November is going to be very um, significant for you guys. Okay. What is this? What is November? What? You guys are going to find some sort of luck when it comes to, um, to romance and money in the month of November. Ciao. This is beautiful. Some of you need to go take a fucking vacation. We got a hammock here. I know I do. Tell me more, Spirit. What the heck is this? Ciao. Community. I don't want to get into the negative shit, but I am seeing some negative shit here. Y'all need to be careful. There could be somebody from your past that might want to come in and they've been watching you. Maybe they know that you work really hard and they want to try to ask you to go on a vacation or go on some sort of trip with them. I don't know why I'm getting something about a trip to Peru, okay? That don't, um, I wouldn't take this offer because we got, we got snake with the, with the flowers here. So I would be just, and then in the bottom of the deck, we got the death card. So just be, I don't know if this is someone trying their best to try to stop you from um, this prosperity that's coming in or your life changing. So just be aware of that, okay? Between 
um, now in November. Yeah. Yeah, there's some sort of choice you're going to have to make. Ooh, damn. Interesting. What else do I need to hear, Spirit? I don't want this one too long. I really don't. What else do they want to hear? I don't want to hear. What do they need to hear? What do they need to hear, Spirit? The heck? What the fuck? Spirit is scaring me a little bit. Okay. Someone might be getting engaged in November. Someone could be from the country. Someone could laugh a lot. Get me out of here. Spirit, <laughs> what the heck is going on? What do they need to hear? We have the answer lies in the moment. Stay awake, be present, and stay faithful to your observations and feelings. Okay. It's so hot right now. I don't know if you guys can see that I'm sweating. We have if you could create anything you wanted, what would it be? Journal or sketch your creations on paper. Start to believe you have limitless possibilities to create in this world. Damn straight. This is exactly what I was saying. At the bottom of the deck, we have miracles happen all the time. Open your mind to miracles and you will start experiencing miraculous coincidences in your life. This is real because I've experienced this myself. Time and time and time again. Miracles are real. I'm also getting like closed mouths don't get fed is also what I'm getting. Yeah, whoever I'm talking to, you're, you are a shaman or that's what you're meant to be. But please do your own research. Don't just do your own research. Tell me more. Some of you could be um, a healer. Okay, someone here is definitely connected with fairies or the fairies are, or you have fairy blood. Okay. If any of those two resonate with you, you're going to be getting some blessings. Okay. But this is because whoever I'm talking to, you are, you are, in, you're working in your passions or on your way to doing your passions or something about that. Okay. Something about your passions. You also could be a fire sign. Let's see what signs is, is this read for? Where did I put those cards? There they are. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels. Who are these signs? What are the zodiac signs for these people? To give them clarification, Spirit. Damn. Someone here could be a Capricorn, or you can have Capricorn somewhere in your chart. Someone here could be a Sagittarius, or you could have Saggy somewhere in your chart. Someone here could be a Libra, or they could have Libra somewhere in their chart. Tell me more, Spirit. Thank you. Someone here could be an Aries or someone could have Aries somewhere in their chart. Okay. Someone here could be a Leo or someone could have Leo somewhere in their chart. Someone here could be a Scorpio or have Scorpio somewhere in their chart. Someone here could be a Cancer or have Cancer somewhere in their chart. Okay. What else? What else do they need to hear? Spirit. Um, what else do I need to know? <laughs> what else do I need to know? Spirit? Yeah, healing path. This is all happening because you decided to choose the healing path.
you guys are now like in the middle of transformation you're getting some form of enlightenment or this is what you're going to receive because you see how she has like this is like a lotus flower that is connected to her her brain her head okay yeah you guys are going to be receiving some sort of information while you sleep okay Sorry, more spirit. Nasty. Okay. <laughs> Sorry, more spirit. Sorry, more. Yeah, some of you might need to forgive your mother. We have stories of my mother. Forgiveness is for you, not them, okay? You know? Parents do their best. They do what they can. You know? It is what it is. We have conscious... Whoever I'm talking to, you are definitely tapped into the divine consciousness. Okay, I also, this is why I said gross. We have sacred sexuality, okay? I don't know who y'all is about to hook up with, okay? But whatever the sex is gonna be like, it's gonna, it's gonna be nothing like you've had before is what I'm getting. I don't know why I'm getting the word tantric. <laughs> Something here is gonna blow your mind, okay? Is what I'm getting. And now I'm getting uncomfortable, <laughs> okay? Um, and some of you really need to spend more time out in mother nature. Okay. I know it's so annoying every time you hear this, but it's the truth. Okay. Go out and take a walk around your neighborhood or some. All right. Or instead of like driving to the store, go walk something, do something. Okay. What else do they need to harsh for it? Oh, you need a knot. That wasn't even picking you up. Let me put that down. Yeah, some of you are about to receive some sort of love here. But I don't want to get too much into it because I don't want chow. <laughs> I know there's not, not all good people watch this channel or watch readings with the best intentions holy spirit holy angels can you tell me what's going on here we have healing healed healer it says healing energy surrounds you and this situation this is beautiful for some of you you guys have already done the healing work okay obviously healing the healing journey never ends okay but whoever i'm talking to you're at the point where you are you can now heal others or help guide others to heal themselves okay tell me more spirit they keep saying connect with nature baby okay it says, you are rejuvenated and inspired by spending time outdoors. Some of y'all need to go hug a tree. Okay, roll in the grass. Breathe in some fresh mountain air. If you live by a mountain, that's not for all y'all. Spirit, <laughs> tell me more. Yeah, and it's time for you to take a goddamn vacation. That's all they keep saying. Okay. It says holiday. It says the answer you're looking for can be found during a vacation, a retreat, or a holiday getaway. Okay. And so much of love life. That's for some of y'all. That's only for those who believe that they, you know, deserve love and are lovable and are going to actually find someone. Listen. For a lot of you, I know you've been hurt by past people, but you need to know that 
if there is a good hearted person like yourself who is willing to love like you love, there is other people like that out there. And you need to have hope that you are going to find this person. Okay? It says the basis of your question involves your romantic life, which is now changing for the better. This will be the end of your reading. Don't forget to like, comment, share, subscribe. It really does help out the channel. Until next time, I love you guys. Bye.